Well, what's going on everyone? So another day here on the site digging, uh, getting that dirt back there and spread out. Now I hadn't had a chance to work on it this past week because I was uh, fairly busy with a lot of things. And today I just got done cutting the yard. So I'm kind of pretty already sweaty now, but <laughs> uh, work never stops around here. So today my friends, we're gonna be working, continue on the site here, uh, getting that pile of dirt moved back there. That's my main goal for it. This is something I've been doing for a while now, and I could uh, just, <laughs> I could just go in here with a shovel and throw all that dirt back there, but that's not the point of having the machinery. You know, you wanna use the machines to do it. Uh, so that's the reason why I'm doing that. Now, today, going to be running the 579 which might be getting an upgrade here I'm actually uh, in the planning process of it right now to upgrade the electronics on it uh, put some little bit better stuff in there uh, of course we'll be running the excavator as always so and uh, the front loader might get run not exactly sure but do want to show you this right here so check this out my friends the dump truck got a little bit of a makeover i decided the uh the other night or the other day actually to uh paint the truck a uh, different color so i decided to go with a you know just a white cab with a uh, satin black dump bed on it and uh that's all i really did to it now in the process of actually doing this to take the cab off it has the lights and the speaker inside of it and right behind the cab is where the ESC is located at. Well, in the mess of trying to get the cab off uh, and trying to unplug the wires from the motherboard there, or circuit board if you want to say, I ended up ripping off the connection to the speaker. So now I have no sound whatsoever coming out of this. And I was a really bummer about it because like, yeah, trying to solder onto a circuit board is one of the hardest things to do and I, wasn't really comfortable about doing it so I was like I ah, better not but uh, it did give me a good insight of what's inside the vehicle and it's actually fairly easy to upgrade this with some better electronics so uh, that might be something that I probably will be doing so it's, it's fairly easy like I said now also talk about here we got a new worker on the crew this is Mary Jane. She is our new uh, operator for some of the machinery. You gotta have a woman to work for us, you know? That way I don't, you know, don't look sexist or racist or anything like that. Uh, of course, you know, if I can get anybody to help me, that would be very appreciated. You know, it's hard to get people to work these days. <laughs> so, uh, and plus you don't wanna have some cool scaled out construction vehicles and be ghost riding them. That's just stupid. <laughs> so. Got her in there. She looks pretty cool. She's got a little safety vest. I mean, that means she's she's all about safety and stuff. So uh, hopefully she'll work out. She'll be operating like the dozer, the front loader, um, any other vehicles really. Uh, of course, we got good old Jose up in there in, in the uh, excavator. So we got him. He's also an official cat rep person. You can see the. <laughs> You can see it right there, cat. And then we got Frank the dump. He's in there. He's running the dump truck. He has always been running the dump truck. Well, he's actually ran a few of the construction vehicles until we got some help. So, yeah. But anyway, it's a beautiful day, a great day to do some digging. Nice wind here. You probably can hear that in the microphone. A little bit of wind and just a beautiful day, somewhat. There it goes. <laughs> So yeah, and the yard looks great. I ended up cutting the yard today. Finally got the push, uh, got the Ryan lawnmower back to working again. So that was good. All it was just like a battery issue, uh, but yeah. So get some light here because we are under the shade. So now like I said I haven't been out here in a while. Um, we do have some leaves falling down, which I can't do anything about that. That's going to happen. The park right now is covered in leaves. I haven't gotten back there and done any maintenance here in a while. Um, just I've just been so occupied with running 
the construction vehicles that I kind of just like, oh, kind of just been doing my thing with the construction vehicles and kind of left this alone. But I definitely need to get out here and straighten it up. Um, so let's have some buddies come down sometime and when they do that's probably when I'll probably do it But uh, I definitely need to get on to that But with being the fall winter months or fall months here all those leaves are gonna start falling down And that's a headache a job to do but anyway Let's go ahead and get into this